Hey, I get it. I know how you feel. Even though I can only see half of your face, I don't need to see the rest because the weight of those brows could pull your head through your chest. Six months locked down and almost out now, every day Dan tweets another reason for us to be proud. He's confident and says we're almost there. But before you include me in those celebrations, I have to say, honestly, I haven't been all here. I've been spread pretty thin trying to worry about absolutely everything. My job, my relationships, my parents, my own health and finances. That's every precious vase. They're usually kept spread out. But if whole lives are being shattered, it shows the size of the rug that's been pulled out. But deep down, I know we'll be okay. I'm grateful for my physical health as I deal with this psychological earthquake. <laughs> it's not appropriate, but sometimes I laugh. Silent but deadly used to describe bots. Then there's the irony of who knew something so soft could make life so fucking hard. But we're still here, an empty city still full of heart. And if there's one thing we should remember, it's that when it comes to community, it's the strength, not the length of these threads that'll keep us together. Stay strong, Victoria.